Hello everyone, I am Mukjit from TechX channel. So today I am going to show you the installation of Ionic framework on your Ubuntu or Linux based system and also making your first Ionic application using Ionic framework and in your Ubuntu based platform. And so first you need to open this website. I will give the link of this website in my description section and you, you can read the whole documentary of Ionic framework. Uh, using that website and finally you can uh, see the link of installation there and if you click on the link the page will open of including all the comments of installation in of Ionic framework so uh, make sure that uh, they have already installed Node.js in your system in case you don't know how to do it just go to my description section uh, the link is given there so you need to open your terminal by pressing ctrl alt and t and uh, just copy the link that is started as sudo npm install dash g cordova and it will install cordova in your system just paste it in your terminal and press enter and enter your password and after pressing enter you need to wait some time and okay for some time now it's done and just go back to page again and click on the linux android note and uh, it will be opened now just copy the what i'm doing there and paste it inside your terminal and press enter okay i think uh, it will no need okay 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 sorry okay so later uh, you need to just uh, copy the link uh, copy the comment of uh, installation of any and paste it inside your terminal just copy and paste it inside and uh, you can see the installation is going on and it will uh, take some time depending on your internet speed and uh, after it completes it will look like this so now go back to your browser again and just copy the uh, next command that is ionic star to do blank space double dash type ionic and uh, open the directory where you want to save your project i am uh, opening the new folder for it and pasting the command inside it and obviously open the terminal uh, into that directory so you can see that my uh, node.js 6.3.1 is installed in my system so i need to install node.js 8.1 uh, in my system to continue the work so after installation of node.js 8.11.1 and you can check the node.js version using node space double death version and you can see that uh, the uh, required version is installed there in case you don't know how to do it just go to my description section it will uh, uh, i think it will help you and just now to copy the command again and paste it inside the terminal into that directory where you want to store your store or save your project and paste it and press enter and just proceed with the terms and it will ask for several times is and no just press y and press enter and and here you need to wait for some time because the ionic is uh, loading uh, some files or folders in your system and creating some directories inside your system and and also it will download the sdk files of ionic in your system so uh, since it's done and you can see the um, error uh, login sign up error so you have to sign up before that so just write ionic space sign up and uh, the page will be opened in your browser just uh, enter your details there uh, just fill up so using your email username password and obviously your name click on get started and i think uh, this account is already exists so i'm uh, changing the email account so now it's done and uh, if you are key starter edition just uh, click on that and uh, select plan and click on case started with pro so now it's done and uh, i think uh, okay 
now it's done i think uh, it is a server problem of anik so that's why they are giving the deadlines and okay just uh, so right now just write uh, ionic space login and it will ask for your email id and password just uh, enter your email id and password what you have given just right now and press enter and it will login into your system and uh, it will ask for some questions now mm. uh, so i'm just keeping the uh, ssh key uh, restoration for now and so after skipping uh, you can also uh, set it later the ssh key and just write the copied uh, code again and press enter and you see that this will run again and again you need to press y and enter so now it will ask to create a new app just uh, point that uh, create a new app and paste enter and now it will ask for your uh, name of your app so i'm just writing my ionic app side that and uh, and again it will ask for uh, git host and if you have an account on git just do the things and you can skip this matter so i am showing this for the ones uh, who are getting problem to accessing git from anik and make it help to them so after uh, authentication it will show like this and uh, just press y and enter and you may skip these terms and uh, okay so now just scroll down and let's see what is in there and uh, you can you can see that the to do folder is uh, made inside your system so just copy and paste that what uh, and is saying and after pasting it you can see the all the files copied over there and you just need to a copy the android platform code that is irony called over platform add android and it will, it will add all the dependencies of the code of android and uh, so finally you can uh, write uh, or copy the ionic code over space build space android and it will build your project uh, so and uh, you have you need to install the android virtual device in your system before that to test your application on your system in case you don't know how to do it just uh, go to youtube and search for it you will get many kind of video that how to install uh, android virtual device on your system and hope uh, that those videos will help you and uh, i will create a video of uh, android virtual device later so and now just uh, wait for some time and let me check uh, and uh, if you want to run that uh, your project inside your emulator just write ionic space called over space emulator and uh, in my system there's some issues in my emulator so that uh, uh, the emulator will not work in my system so if you want to publish your application just copy the uh, command of from the ionic website and obviously if you want to publish that uh, just copy and paste that so i'm just showing that and it will not work for now because i don't have installed uh, in uh, my system the android virtual device so you can you can open android studio for that and uh, i'm showing using my android studio 
so after opening android studio you need to select the project just open the project directory and then the platforms and then select android and just uh, click on ok and it will load uh, the files in your system in your android studio so after loading it uh, it will look like this and uh, if you want to run it uh, from the virtual device you can select any of the virtual device installed in your android studio and it will work and so for me uh, the android virtual device will not work for me so you i am just showing you building the apk file so if you click on the build and then build apk and it will uh, show the the apk file and uh, i'm just copy so if you copy the apk file inside your device and install it and open it you can see the default ionic framework application is there and you can change it according to your core base and hope you enjoyed this video for more this kind of video please click on the subscribe and like button and if you are a football lover don't forget to subscribe the daily fc channel and the link is given there until then this kyle barsa the link of the daily fcb channel is given in my description session you can check it out